this is Lake Nahur is the highest lake in the whole Azerbaijan. And many people still believe that Sheikh Muhammad was an angel and he never died. Welcome to our Azerbaijan travel series. So far we have explored the fascinating city of Baku and the captivating region of Qabustan which has been inhabited since prehistoric times and even witnessed the natural wonder of the mud volcanoes. As you have seen in the previous episodes, my brother and his family have flown all the way from Iran to join us on this adventure. And I'm excited to introduce you to my lovely niece and nephew, who are thrilled to be part of this exciting journey with us. In today's video, we are delighted to take you along with us on a day trip to Gabala with the small Azerbaijan tour. Join us as we visit the historical Diri Baba Mausoleum, admire the stunning Nohu Lake and walk up to the Seven Beauties waterfalls. Let's go because we are late and our tour guide is waiting for us. Let's go! We are here for a short stop and I didn't have breakfast. And I'm ordering ice latte. It's really hot today. So, uh, but the first stop of the day is Diri Baba. It's the tomb of Sheikh Muhammad, which was a Darwish. Darwish is kind of holy person in the past. And they follow Islam and I would say branch of Islam that calls Sufi. It's a peaceful religion and it's inspiring people not to fight and be in peace with yourself and with others. That's why most of the kings in the past, they didn't like their wish, of course, Sheikh Muhammad. And Sheikh Muhammad had the last wish and he wanted to see where he would be buried. When he found his grave, he started living in his grave, like while he was alive. And then he died while he was praying. And many locals here, they believe that his body is not anymore there, he just, disappeared. These are all the story, we don't know the truth, but the local people here, they believe this is the holy place. And sometimes some locals, they say they hear some voices praying, but now we are going to see inside. According to some legends, Sheikh Muhammad had miraculous powers and was known for his ability to heal the sick. He is also called Diri Baba, which means a live grandfather because and many people still believe that Sheikh Muhammad was an angel and he never died and he's alive. When we got away from Baku, the landscape was kind of dry and no trees, no greenery. But then when we passed Shamakhe, which is a city in Azerbaijan, the scenery changed completely. And here is really green. And this road is so beautiful. The trees merged together and they made a tunnel. And the road is so beautiful. Yeah. She's not tired, she's just hungry. And that's the good news for her that we are going to a restaurant. Did 
the view here is amazing. And now it's time to eat. Actually, in Azerbaijan, I think the food is great. Whatever we had, we really enjoyed it. And I ordered some sort of kebab, beiti. And also Bruno ordered something. It's with kind of yogurt, aubergine, and kebab in aubergine. So it's, let's eat. to go on the lake. She says that, Auntie, when your legs are tired, I am going to switch with you. <laughs> See how sweet she is. <laughs> this is Lake Nohur, is the highest lake in the whole Azerbaijan. It used to be a river but after the earthquake the mountain collapsed and now is the lake and the source of this lake is just rainwater oh i'm out of breath because this little lady makes me work i should go fast it's a competition this way this is do another cycling. It's time to say bye to this lake and go and get a cable car and have a great view. The ticket for cable car is 16 manat per person. For the school children, like for my niece, is only 10 manat. The city of Gabala in Azerbaijan is surrounded by the country's highest peaks and the cable car took us up to an altitude of 1920 meters where we enjoyed a stunning panoramic view of the area. This region is also a great place for skiing during the winter. And we arrive in the last stop, the seven beautiful waterfalls. We have to climb some stairs and we just saw the first one, the first waterfall. We saw the second one. And this waterfall behind me is the third one. We still have a long way to go. The Seven Beauties waterfall in Azerbaijan is a true natural wonder that cascades down a series of seven terraces, each with its own unique beauty. We hiked up to the fourth terrace since we didn't have time. However, to see all seven terraces, you need to hike for around two hours. <laughs> 